Dave, we have a Mo Bamba trade. Mo Bamba is going to the Los Angeles Lakers in exchange for Patrick Beverly and a second round pick going back to Orlando. Man, Mo Bamba finally found himself a new home in Los Angeles. I'll I'll admit this. I'm a little confused. I'm a little confused <laughs> about what's going on here. Um, you know, they're taking a flyer on a young backup big, I guess. Um, you know, they But are they we not... trying to make the play in? Are we trying to make the playoffs? Like I'm not sure. I'm not really sure where we're <laughs> going here. Like, which way I, are we shifting? Moving Pat Bev is a smart move. He he's an expiring contract. You want to get off of him. The second round pick that they sent, they just got in the deal that sent Thomas Bryant to the Nuggets. So they didn't really give up a lot to take a flyer on Mo Bamba. We could put him in the same category as like Rui Hachimura or even uh, sure. Cam Reddish, who they'll bring in in the summer. It's a guy you bring in, kick the tires on him, get him in house, see if he's talented. They've had interest in Mo Bamba previously. Like we, we, we all know that they kind of kick the tires on him when he was a free agent or uh, approach a free agency. Um, it's not a bad deal for them to, to bring a guy in and, and check him out. And yeah. they're they're losing Pat Beverly, who I'm I'm guessing may wind up on the buyout market, um, and and he could be a guy that's added to a team, or maybe they keep him around in Orlando and he helps mentor these young guards and turn them into fierce competitors. Maybe he ends up on the table in the play-in again. I mean, who knows with Orlando? Listen, Orlando's pretty good, man. Uh, they're, they're not as bad as they were to start the season, and if anybody was going to help them sort of make a push to the play and it would be Patrick Beverly. The guy leaves it out all on the court. And even if he doesn't like the guys necessarily, like when he comes in, I mean, we saw how he was an ultimate teammate with LeBron and with Russ. I, I think they had a lot of, you know, good chemistry there as, as far as uh, camaraderie goes. So I think he's yeah. a good guy to bring into a young team. And if they do keep him around, it's not going to make you worse. I mean, it, no. it's definitely not going to make you worse. So maybe he sticks around, but if Pat Beverly hits the buyout market, there are going to be teams that are looking at him. He can stick a three when he's wide open, and you know that he brings some of the intangibles that that some teams lack. So, um, yeah. and, and we we talked about this a little bit. Would love to see him go back to Minnesota. He's a guy that yeah, they could really sure. use in that locker yeah. room. You know, a little bit of a leadership has some cachet there. So uh, we'll see if he sticks around. But the the story of this trade is Mo Bamba, and if he can stretch the floor for the Lakers a little bit coming off the bench, backing up who I guess Anthony Davis is going to be the starting five. Now, uh, yeah. if he can back him up adequately, it's a big deal, but if he can't, he's not playing in the playoffs all that much anyway. No, he's not playing in the playoffs. And we just talked about the reason that they traded Thomas Bryant was because they wanted minutes for Jared Vanderbilt. You know, this is still this plenty is a, of minutes for Jared Vanderbilt. I, I don't think Mo Bamba is stealing minutes from anybody. There are lies being passed around the internet today, Dave DeFore, about Jander, Jared Vanderbilt minutes. I don't like it. I don't like that at all. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I think it's it's a fine deal. I I actually do like you said. I like Pat Bev with the Magic. I think bringing some attitude there. Honestly, the Lakers, they they may have had some of the most toed in the league yesterday, today, it's all gone. The it's alley done. attitude's gone. It's kind of, kind of interesting how that works. You know, they got rid of a few guys that played with some real competitive fire. And yeah. I'm not saying that LeBron doesn't, or that Anthony Davis doesn't, although, I mean, I think we all know that Anthony Davis, it waxes and wanes, but giving up Russell Westbrook, Patrick Beverly, and even Thomas Bryant, who really did. I mean, when he's rolling, that guy is really good and, and really impactful. But giving up Russ and giving up Patrick Beverly, I mean, who's going to provide energy for these guys? Um, I want to see who's going to step up and kind of fill that role for the Lakers because I, I know that basketball has done so much on paper now and everyone yeah. just looks at stats. But you can't watch those Laker games and and see how Patrick Beverly and Russell Westbrook really do keep those guys going when it starts to fall apart. And I don't mean necessarily that they contribute to winning basketball, but there's a lot more to winning games than just putting the ball in the hoop. And, and so the, the Lakers are going to have to find a way to, to kind of, you know, rekindle that energy from somewhere. Or it's just, you know, they're going to flame out. Are you trying to tell me Bomba's not bringing the fire? No. <laughs> no. 
<laughs> Not, I mean, is he going to sing his own song when he comes in? Is he going to go get, you know, beat up by Austin Rivers again? I, I, I don't know. But, hey, Austin Rivers did tell him that Orlando is his city. And we see yeah. Mo Bamba didn't stick around very long. So he, he wasn't wrong. He wasn't wrong about that. Get out of here, Mo Bamba. Mo Bamba is a Laker. Uh, go get yourself a Mo Bamba jersey today, Lakers fans. That'll be that'll be a prized possession. I actually I actually kind of like to have a Mo Bamba Lakers jersey. That's gonna be a weird one. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> down, <laughs> down the road. <laughs> uh, thanks so much for listening. Let us know in the comments what do you think about this trade. Are you a big Bamba lover? Let us know. Like the like this video. Subscribe to the Athletic NBA Show here on YouTube and stay locked in to the Athletic.